I didn't think to look for an out outlet outside. Because I hate working. That's what happens when you procrastinate. You guys, now you guys had to stick your fat ass through that window. Welcome back to another day, guys. Today, I'm going to do a week, productive week, in my life as a new home homeowner. So, if you guys don't know what a homeowner does, and you're like, ooh, I want to buy a house soon, I'm going to buy a house soon, I want to know what my weeks will look like, you know, what my responsibilities will be like, this is kind of it. So, this week, I have a lot to do. I have to get my trash set up. Because I was not aware I had to get that set up. You know, I thought I was just going to get a bill in the mail and I'd start paying it. No. No, so no. So I have to go get that set up. Um, I have to mow my grass. Because I have a yard. Backyard and a front yard now. So I got to mow that. Um, I'll be doing a bunch of Walmart runs. Um, um, I'm also going to try setting up some Halloween decorations. Very, very late. But I just wasn't able to get to it this week. I love the sirens in the background. All right, so back to the video. Um, so I'm also going to be getting ready for Halloween. I'm so excited for Halloween. I'm going to be handing out candy. Um, I'm part of a Facebook group chat, basic a Facebook page for my town. So I'm like asking questions about it, and I was like, oh yeah, it's a big thing in our town. Make sure you get lots of candy. And they told me like what times and everything. They also told me where to go get for trash service, so that was very helpful. So, um, getting ready for Halloween, just general upkeep of my house, cleaning, finishing, unpacking, moving, stuff around. I have so much still to unpack, so come along. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's go. But the fact that I logged myself out the day I started to record myself is unreal. I was literally like, oh my gosh, I'm getting, oh, I'm like getting so ahead, you know, like getting stuff done. Locks myself out. Are you kidding me? And the guys who changed my locks, the guys literally like put one of the keys somewhere that is not in the house. Have I listened? No, because I'm a procrastinator. That's what happens when you procrastinate. You guys, now you guys had to stick your fat ass through that window. The cats were shook at me popping through that window. They're like, what the hell? Everyone said, get lots of candy. Especially if I'm like in the surrounding of the town, which I kind of am. So, fun dips. Um, one thing with the candy, I have a little pumpkin head guy out here. His head like can hold stuff, so I'm gonna put some candy in there. And I'm gonna sign up for mailmen and delivery people to take some, because I ordered a lot recently. Um, lint thing because the cat's hair is all over me all the time and then some scentsy because i had run out oh my gosh this smells so good this camera's terrible at focusing on other things there we go girlfriend's night smells so good bubbly berry bliss it's what i imagine like that girl's house to smell like or like her chic apartment so we'll smell like that This place is a mess. I need to 
start cleaning it if I want to get anything done tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> as I was pulling, not even five minutes, like I was down the street. It takes 36 minutes to get here. They offered VTO. Did I take it? Yes, I did. Cause I was going to work two to six shift and then 7.30 to 11.30. I guess who's going home right now? Me. Is it a waste of gas? Yes. Do I care? No. No, 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 I don't. Because I, I hate working, honestly. If we're gonna be honest, I hate working. It is the bane of my existence. If I could never work again in my life, I so would. But, you know, we live in the world, real world. We live in America. So, work until you die. I'm going home for two, three, four, five, five hours. Then I'll come back, unless they offer VTO for that shift. I wanted a bigger one, but it was like $134. So I'm like, I'm not spending that much money on a trash can. So this one's a good size. Also, I ran over a skunk yesterday, and now my car smells like skunk, my garage smells like skunk, and it has traveled into my house, and now it smells like skunk everywhere. And I I'm self-conscious because I think I smell like skunk. So, I need to Google how to get rid of it. <laughs> I can't doubt my car and um, tomato soup. So. All right, so here's all my outdoor decorations. So these are all the bush lights. And that's just an uh, extender in case I need it. Wall clings. Some like cats that go in the grass. This blow up, and then that's another blow up. I'll show you. And then my Halloween costume is an astronaut. I don't know why I picked it, but we'll see how it looks. A little boobage. Oh. Here's my costume. Oh my gosh. This looks crazy. Hi. It doesn't look that bad, I don't think. I don't even know if you can hear me. We're ready for space. <laughs> He's so shook. There's me. So, oh, I kind of like it. I was like, I'm gonna be so upset if it doesn't fit. But it's a two X, so. It's a nice, nice uh, material. You know, it doesn't feel too cheap, but it's not like, oh, this is gonna keep me warm, <laughs> you know? So I kinda like it. You wanna see? Come here. How are you? He just wants the plastic.
after just freezing my toes off because I don't want to put shoes on outside because I was like okay let me go find out where all the outlets are before I take anything out there you know start setting up the blubs and the lights tell me why there's not a single outlet out front not one on on my house not one and I'm like that's crazy you know like yeah I understand it's an old house but like not even one like outlet and so I'm like okay I guess I'll get like a crap ton of extension cords and run one from my garage my garage only has one outlet one single one one that will it has like two you know like a regular one <laughs> and one will hold um my fridge but this entire outlet is on the other side of the garage so it's like towards my backyard it's not even towards the front so if i wanted to do a cord i would have to do it clear across my garage that won't work i park my car in the garage so i don't know what i'm gonna do about that i, I need outlets out there how am i supposed to do my decorations and my christmas that's so sad um guess i'll have to save these for next halloween and like yeah it's pretty late in the season anyway and like they would be up for 10 days but i was just like so busy with work and just the gang moved in so i guess i'll put these guys out that's what i'll do that'll be the extent of my halloween decorations i think maybe sunday i'll um sunday or monday i'm going to go get pumpkins maybe go to my mom's she has fields maybe get some like corn stalks put them on the fly side there oh my god dude stop licking plastic i don't know why you lick plastic it's so weird someone tell me why cats lick plastic it's so weird it's just him he does it i think he does it to annoy me because he knows i don't like the sound so i'm sad now that's so upsetting I legit spent like a hundred dollars no almost like 200 on that decor that's so upsetting I sh I didn't think to look for an out outlet outside I'm used to houses having outlets like I don't understand <sighs> so I'll put those out but then I think that'll be the end of this vlog um, so thank you guys for watching hope it was interesting so you guys if you are not a homeowner so you know what it's going to be like to be a home homeowner um lesson one make sure your house has outlets before you buy a whole bunch of decorations outside make sure you know where the outlets are yeah, so um lesson number two is get a mower if you need a mower if you have grass that's a whole new thing for me so Thank God my dad gave me his mower, so I was like, thank you, Dad. So, but thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you at the next one. See ya.